If you like seafood, you must know about oysters. But do you know about flower clams? In this video, I have an explosively spicy and crunchy recipe for you. So let's get right into it. These are what we call flower clams. You can get them in the supermarket or online. In my case, I bought them online. They are very easily available, although delivery may take some time depending on where we live. Unlike oysters, flower clams are meaty and sweet in taste. And they have lots of protein but are low in fat. This is the tend to be cooked with them are pasta, rosetto, chowder or you can even stir fry them or steam them. Today we are going to stir fry them which is very simple yet tricky. So I hope you can follow up every steps in this video until the end. Ok, let's start by removing these lands sands inside these flower clamps because there are many occasions when the gritty sand in the clamps just ruins the whole experience. So it is a very important step. To remove the sand, I am going to rinse these flower clamps thoroughly and add in some salt so that these clamps will open. I am going to soak them in this pot for 20 minutes. In the meantime, I am going to ready my ingredients and sauce. I am starting with 10 thinly sliced red chilies because I want these flower clamps to be very spicy, 6 thinly sliced garlic, 2 green peppers for extra flavor and ginger to enhance their meaty flavor. To prepare the sauce, I'm going to pour uh, 2 spoons of cooking wine in this bowl, 4 spoons of uh, light soy sauce, 2 spoons of oyster sauce, 1 spoon of white sugar, 3 spoons of cornstarch, and 5 spoons of water. And I'm going to mix them very well. Next, I'm going to rinse the soaked flour clam. And boil them in a few cups of water. After boiling, I'm going to drain the hot water and uh, soak them in cold water to stop overcooking. Also, I'm going to rinse them properly for one last time. Now let's fry them. I'm heating a pan on a gas stop and I'm going to dry it clean. After it has been dried clean, I'm going to add 2 tablespoons of oil. Before the oil is heated too much, I'm going to add a handful of citron pepper, ginger and garlic slices. These are the most flavorful aromatics and we want them to fry until they are golden brown. Then I'm going to add all the well rinsed flour clams into the pan. and stir gently to avoid flour clams falling out of the pan. Now, I'm going to add sauce that we made earlier and again stirring them gently for a while. Now I'm going to add red chilies and green pepper and stir again for 5 minutes. And our dish is ready. But I'm going to add about half a glass of beer to enhance their taste. It is completely my preference and not necessary for you to do the same. Finally, tasty, crunchy, and of course, spicy flour clams are ready to be served. These clams with a glass of beer would be just perfect. You can eat it as breakfast, lunch, dinner, as a snack, however you like. If you want to know how to make it, product, the link is in the description. You can go and watch that. Until next time, happy cooking.